Hi, I'm Tim. I'm Jerry. And we're Tim and Jerry from Vinny's Vault. We're starting a brand new YouTube channel and we're going to call it Vintage and Vino. Vintage Cheers. and Vino. Cheers. <laughs> So, so you, what we're going to do today, yesterday we went on like five estate sales and the first, after the first four, we were like, oh, this is terrible. This is just not a good day. We hadn't bought in, no, we bought like two, two we items, bought two items, two items at like the third one yeah. and the other ones were just trash. I mean, they were terrible. Uh, but then we found the mother load. I mean, the best th we bought over a hundred dollars worth of stuff and uh which is nothing which is vintage vintage stuff at this one estate sale and we recorded the sale but the recording didn't turn out so good we have to practice at that we're not very good at that yet so we're just going to do a haul video of what we got yesterday and show you guys everything that we got and we got some really That's awesome right. stuff and if you're interested in any of this stuff Vinny's vault dot etsy dot com and that'll get you right to our webpage and, and you can purchase it. Uh, send us a message, Vinny's Vault at gmail.com. Send us a message on an email message. Uh, yeah, before we even list it, we're happy to sell it to you. If it's I still available. I think we'll get it listed on Tuesday. Here we're going to start with something that's not real exciting, but kind of cool. And <laughs> I'll let Jerry tell you all um, about all this stuff. I'll remember hold some the of it up. 70s? Okay, here's Corel, salt and pepper, and sugar. Now, I know you've seen the salt and pepper a lot, but here's the sugar shaker as well. Three-piece so set. So we are pretty excited to find this three-piece set in the yellow with the flowers, 1970s, love it. Oh, wait, we didn't tell you about this sale. We didn't even get oh. a chance to tell you that we, there were paths. I, I, there were paths through These this stuff. These people were hoarders. <laughs> okay, I wasn't going to say it. <laughs> but, yeah, there were paths, and you just had to kind of dig through everything. So, that was the first, one of the one of the items that we got. Yeah. We bought, also, I'm going to just dive right into this. Are you going to go into that? Yeah, oh, I'm going to dive right into this it. This was so exciting. <laughs> they said it was a complete set. What's the name of it? Hadley. M. She said, Hadley. I have some Hadley. And Tim said, Jared, she says she has Hadley. And I went, M.A. Hadley? And she pulled it out. And so here we go. It wasn't a complete set, no, but, but it's, it's a lot of serving pieces. Fantastic. And a lot of the plates and, and salad dishes. Mm -hmm. Here's the first one. I'm going to take this lid off of it so we don't break, drop it and break it. Mm -hmm. Here's the lid for it. I'm a little unsure about this lid. Y'all tell me if you know, it fits a little loose. So I don't know if this, here's the picture. It's a huge, you can see, it's a huge picture. It's got a cow and a pig. Um, Turn it over so you can see the may have it. Obviously, oh, is it upside down? No, that was right. Yeah. No, I don't know. I don't know, there you go. It may no, have No, that's it. upside down. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> um, unbelievable piece. But this lid feels. Here, hold this. There you hold that. It feels a little loosey goosey. I mean, it fits. It covers the hole. It fits, but it doesn't really fit. So I'm not really mean. sure. So y'all, let me know. This is a 13-inch serving platter. Mm -hmm. Again. And this is all the, the most are all of it is the country pattern. M.A. Hadley. Mm -hmm. Okay. Country pattern. The 13 inch server. 13 or, inch serving plate. Or chop plate or platter or whatever you want to call it. Veggie plate, anything. I don't there know. it is. It's huge. Excellent, it's, excellent piece. Excellent piece. No issues, no chips, no cracks. We'll let you know if they do have those. Okay, go ahead. We have mugs. Those are cups. 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 Okay. Cups. No saucers, just cups. Yeah. It has the farmhouse on it. And look at the uh, inside. The, this is the nice, the funny part. Yeah, when you, you get know. when you get to the bottom, it says the end. Yeah. <laughs> and 
And there are two of those. Yeah, there we have two. two. Oops, sorry. Yeah, two uh, of the of the cups. So, like I said, it wasn't here. Like Tim said, it wasn't a whole set, but some beautiful, wonderful pieces. Here are a couple of mugs. Mm -hmm. One with a little lamb on it. One with a pig on it. And the end. The end on this one too. Uh, M. A. Hadley. Beautiful pieces. Okay, go ahead. Uh, this is a, no. Like, don't do that one yet. That one's like this is like the fiesta, fiesta result, resistance, whatever you call it. We yeah. think it's a wall. It's wall decor. It's a wall decor, or it could probably could also be, be used trivet. as a trivet. It could be a trivet on the top. Yeah. Uh, because it's got little little ridges right here to hold like a bowl to keep it from sliding mm -hmm. off. So it's got a little bump right here, a little bump right here. It's heavy. But this is, uh, like I said, it's got a rope attached to it. Yeah, and this piece is fairly rare. There's There's been a couple of pieces for sale online, none right now. And so and it's- There again. It's it pretty may, rare. It may have It may have leak. Okay, we're just gonna show them one of these. Yeah, right? I want. Well, they've all got different animals. They've yeah. all got different animals. Here's the bowls. These are the regular, oh gosh, seven inch? I no, think. they're not. They're probably five inch. Five? I don't know. Anyway, they're all, there's five of them. This is a pig. And we've got a chicken and a cow and a house and, and another a, house. And a barn. Oh, a barn and a house. There you go. So there's five of those with the set. So there you go. Let's take a break. A few inches later. We're back. We need a little more light. Hopefully yeah. this is, we this didn't, is better. Yeah, hopefully yeah. it's better. We didn't realize it, but our camera light wasn't on, but just our, our kitchen light. Anyway, these are the saucers. And this again, is so exciting. Again, we have six of these. Six, uh, they're not saucers. They're salad plates. They're salad plates. Men. <laughs> what do I know? What do you know? <laughs> Okay, so I have a pig. 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 M.A. Hadley, of course. Cow. Cow. Hadley. No, what you got? Oh, chicken. Barn. Hadley. Hadley. Look at that, look at that. Oh, love it, now, love it, love it. These two, these last two have some minor I chips. I know that. Yeah, and this one's got one I'm back so here, I'm so happy about that. Look at this one. This one's got one back I knew here. that one. See, this one has a chip. This one has a chip right in here. In the back, which isn't as see it. quite as obvious in the front. See a little bit in the front if you're really looking for it. You see that little chip right there in the front. But, I mean, this is the house. And this then this the, one's... This is the lamb. This it's is the lamb, and unfortunately, it. it has a chip right on the front. So... We make a swing and deal yeah, on the chip ones. There you go. We're making a swing and deal on the chip. That's the only thing that was chipped in the whole now, three boxes of I'm stuff. I'm gonna have to get up and get this up. Okay. And we have six dinner plates. And none of them are chipped. No chips on the six dinner plates. So I have the lamb. These are the 11 inch dinner plates. I have the lamb, Adley. And there's the cow. There's the farmhouse. The farmhouse. There's the house. Oh, here's another farmhouse. There's another farmhouse. Two farmhouses. Two farmhouses. And here's the pig. And you can't forget the pig. So. There's Hadley. Yeah. None of the dinner plates are chipped. They're all in perfect, pristine condition. Mm -hmm. Now, the next piece is another one that's kind of hard to come up on. And it's the napkin holder. So. That is another service piece that is excellent. Excellent condition, beautiful. Okay, what okay. else you got? This, oh, this is the best, I like this. This piece is awesome. I like this piece. This is this is my, my favorite probably out of the whole thing. Not uh, because you like honey. I like honey. <laughs> sweets to the sweet. Mm -hmm. It's a honey bowl. See the bees and the honey and, and the beehive? And it even still has Yes, the little honey scooper thingy. What do you call it? I don't know, the dipper, the I guess, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> there it is. So there it is. Uh, now this piece, this well, is- Yeah, a, that's this the is last a, one. This is the last Hadley piece. But and it is not country. All of these were from the country pattern. We're not sure, this, is, no, this one is, this is or not. No, this is from the coastal pattern. Coastal pattern, okay. Mm -hmm. It has the palm tree. It has the palm it's tree It's the small pitcher. It's the small pitcher. 
It's uh. Mm -hmm. There you go. Give me a Hadley. Yeah. Um, just Still a picture. Hadley. That's Step a over. lot of Hadley. Now you can tell them what we paid for the Hadley. We paid $40 for $40. all of this all Hadley, Hadley stuff. 40 bucks. From That's the hoarder. It. <laughs> it's just a lot of stuff. There was just a lot. But hey, they're selling it and that's a good thing. How okay. about this one next? I have no, I don't know anything about that, but you can show it. Um, I think it's gorgeous. It, it, it's so Christmassy to me. It's a vase and it has the, obviously art glass and it has the red and yellow and then green down here. Well, it's got to be blown glass, but I don't know who did it. So there you go. But it's gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Oh, show nice. me the other one like it. Yeah, this one's Yeah, good. these we thought maybe matched because it, green. It's it got has green some in green it. in it too. And it's got the red at the top. Mm -hmm. And it's got these little coily this. coils for mm -hmm. the handles. But there are no markings on the bottom of it. It looks blown as well. I don't know how they would do it, but it Well, it they does. polish the bottom so well that you can't yeah. even see the pontal. Um... I thought maybe Viking, but I don't know. I'm guessing. I am guessing. But it's just so. a beautiful little. It is definitely dish or not Blanco. So yeah. not on him. Doesn't look like Murano either. At the all. green is kind of hard to see, but it's in these these little runs right here in each little leaf. There's some green and red and amber. So wow, oh, it's pretty. I had to have it, and the price was right. Back to the 70s, yes, because this is so much fun. You know, you, you just gotta have it. Yeah. You just gotta have it. A little creamer. creamer and there's bottle. so much creamer and it's or got, syrup. Or syrup, might be a syrup bottle, syrup? yeah. Yeah, but it's ice. so detailed, so look at the lines mm -hmm. on it and then it's it's got the, the in little, the bottom. The little rosette kind rosette of thing. thing in the bottom. But you know, I suspect it might've been from a restaurant. I don't know. Maybe. I don't I mean, think it would have been did, as detailed if did it was people, from a restaurant. I mean, my mom didn't, but did people actually take the syrup out of the glass bottle and pour it into... <laughs> we never did. No. Ours was so, in Jemima, right out of the I bottle. I think it might have been a restaurant <laughs> because we didn't have mothers that did that. I don't know. This is the best. A little and bit of wall decor Let here. me tell you, when I picked this up, he, my daughter and son-in-law were with us as well. <laughs> and, and I picked them up and, the, and they all went... Oh, really? And I'm like, yes, they're fantastic because there are a lot of seamstresses and quilters that like to decorate their craft room. A pair of wooden scissors. It's got a little. It's perfect. Little uh, hanger right? on the back for hanging out on the wall. It's fun. And it's you know. It's. Mm -hmm. a pair of scissors. Yes, and we paid a whole buck seventy-five. I don't know what we paid for. Buck seventy-five. Now, this was Tim's find. I found this one. He was very excited. And well, we found it or not, the Hadley, too. Believe so. it or not, it was back in the man cave of this house. Why would this be in the man cave? I don't know. But <laughs> He's not putting it in his man cave. No, it's not going in my man cave, that's for sure. But it's a McCoy. I don't know, let's see the bottom of it. There. Two tulip, double tulip. McCoy, double tulip. I don't know if you planter. can see it on there, but it says McCoy yeah. on the bottom of it. Mm -hmm double planter, pink and white, very desirable. It has a little bit of crazing on it, which is really nice. But no chips. But no, no chips anywhere, no cracks anywhere. So this is pretty. a pristine piece right here, let me tell you. Oh, here, let's talk about this. Okay. This is interesting. Okay, so we picked this up. This has been a little bit, but I can yeah, fix that. that That's can be, problem. He fixes a lot of stuff. Yeah, I'm a good fixer. He's a good fixer. Um, We picked this up. Put it back so you can see the whole thing. Oh my gosh, because a few days ago we picked up a shade that's white and gold and we just loved the shade. And so we thought, we'll either just sell the shade or we'll find a lamp. Well, we picked this lamp up and thought, oh, this is perfect for that shade. But, but it don't fit. It's too small. The lamp is too small for the shade. So here's a lesson. Measure your lamps, measure your shades. <laughs> but you know what? I just noticed something. I could probably take this apart. We could probably replace the shade ring and reuse that shade. What? <laughs> Put a new one here? Put a new ring, yeah. Oh, okay. Okay, Come but on. you gotta admit, 
That That's shade a beautiful shade. Let me, let me is gorgeous this. with look at that. This lamp. Yeah. Show them that. Oh, this. Yeah. What do you All right. You so this is this is a, a vase, a Jack in the Pulpit. Jack in the Pulpit. Vase. Which you know, I learned from watching YouTube. Um, with these glass flowers in it. They come out. Look at these that. beautiful roses, glass roses. Aren't they pretty? Like. It's almost Valentine's Day, people, right? There Look you at go. That. Look how nice this would be, and it's got a little. <sighs> and this like one a is tulip. This one's gorgeous. It has a purple stem. So, yeah. And then, of course, the vase has this twisted, this twisted green and white jack in the pulpit. And here's the bottom. This is so right pretty. Here. And I'm just going to sell this as a set. Absolutely. This is the way I bought it. And I thought, you know, this has got to be, this has got to stay together. What else? You How about some Easter stuff? Easter's on its way. You're not going to stop it. That's right. Uh, and we have this absolutely gorgeous little bunny picture that doesn't have a head. No, just kidding. <laughs> the head's right here. <laughs> I almost did a wine spit take. <laughs> See this little bunny? How cute is that? Mm -hmm. It's a teapot. And it's a teapot. And, and it's, it's very colorful. What brand is it? I'm gonna take the I'm gonna take Who's the, the lid maker? off. Mr. Tim. This is I don't know how to say Odigiri. it. Odagiri. 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 But look yes. at the colors. Look how bright and vibrant the mm -hmm. colors are. Greens, orange, mm -hmm. peach color, white, beautiful. Brown hat. This is a cute, cute, Very cute little teapot. Very good Easter teapot. decor. Very good Easter, Easter decor. Yeah. Here's the next Easter bunny, though. Another little Easter bunny. Yeah. This is called Modern, Modern Easter or something like me. that. I don't know. Well, it's not vintage, really. I think it's from about 2009 or 10. So it'll be going on eBay. It's going on eBay. Um, but it's it's so cute. It's just it's really cute. And they made them in with different colored eggs. So this one's blue. I've seen them with pink and with kind of a chartreuse. Oh, and the blue cobalt. We bought some blue cobalt, yes. a couple of different Now ones. this is an interesting one. And I also would, I don't know about you, but I would value some help on this one because as I looked it up, it was all pointing to Westmoreland, but there's no W on this. There's nothing that points to it being Westmoreland, so maybe Indiana glass, but I'm, it's gorgeous. It's cobalt, which is very desirable. And no it's chips just sweet. It. No chips anywhere. It's just sweet with it's the love birds. Beautiful. It's perfect for Valentine's yeah. Day. Perfect, yes, with the love birds. I love it. This, yeah. this is, I mean, this, I told Jerry, I said, guess what I have in my hand? And it went, it's a blue cobalt cat on a nest. Yeah. It is so it's cute. Kitty on a nest. It's tiny. And this one is Westmoreland. It is marked Westmoreland. It's got a W around the yeah. bottom. It's kind of vague to see it, but it is there. So this one is definitely is Westmoreland. Little trinket. I mean, put it on your bedside table. Put Again. your rings in it at night. Yeah. Again, no chips, no uh, cracks. Perfect shape. He's beautiful. Yeah. Beautiful. Yeah. This, I can't remember the name. Kozan Gala or Gama? Gama. Kozan Gama. Gama. Yeah. I thought it was Amari. So when we started doing the research, that's where we started, but it was not. And apparently this cake plate is, this pattern is called Kozan Gama because I looked up this, this sign, Japanese sign, and that's what it said. Gama stands for kiln, so it's the Koza, Kozan oh, kiln. Some of the flowers on the bottom half of it. This yeah. was really, when we picked it up, I'm like, this is quality because when they go to the trouble of putting those flowers underneath like that, to me, that just speaks quality. Yeah, it's just gorgeous. And this is the pattern. Mm -hmm. I don't know if you can see it, but it's flowery. But yeah, it's, it's nice. Mm -hmm. It's beautiful. It's a beautiful cake, cake plate. It's about 10 and a half inches. In around so mm -hmm. cookies you know cookies on it serving platter pastries whatever, you know? yeah. whatever yeah. yeah this is one of jerry's finds yeah. this is a royal copley mm -hmm. and it's gorgeous 
Not a crack on it, not a chip on it anywhere. It's beautiful. A little red bird on it. It just looks like a bird bath to me. Yeah, it does. You know, does I don't like know it. what you'd put in it for a bird or whatever. But maybe a plant, maybe some candy. But, oh, it's just gorgeous. This is a really pale, pale greenish blue. And the, the bird is pink. And, and you can see the blue right along the top there. Mm -hmm. And it kind of just fades into the it white fades. underneath. And then you can, it's, it's signed on the Royal bottom. Copley. Yeah, it is Royal Copley. It's signed right mm -hmm. there. Let's see. Here you go. I don't know what this okay, is. Okay, well, you know Maybe what? I just, this is a, I'm trying to remember the word. Anthropomorphic rabbit. He's wearing clothes. See, he has pants on. He has little blue jeans on. And he has a sweet little face. And he's hugging his carrot. And I picked it up just because it's Easter and it's cute and it's the perfect, perfect decor to put with more rabbits. And so, yes, that's why I picked it up. Made in Italy. Italy salt and pepper. Salt mm -hmm. and pepper shit. And they're signed by the, uh, by the artist, Van Rowe. Right, Van Rowe. V, v Rowe. I think it's Van Rowe. I think it's a V A N. -R -O. Oh yeah, V A N R O. Uh -huh. Van Rowe. And Italy. it's, um, I guess he did a lot, and it was like '60s or '70s that he did these. Uh, like that a, he was more prominent in Italy. It's like the Italian countryside. Mm -hmm. And I think it's so important, very important. <laughs> Salt and pepper shakers need to have sure. different size holes because the pepper doesn't come out. The salt shaker is very good, and this one does. It has larger holes on the pepper mm -hmm. shaker. He's very picky about the, the salt, salt pepper. pepper. That's true. Yes. That's true. So anyway, yeah, yeah, it's countryside, cabin, cottage, whatever you want to call it. Uh, one's missing a cork, but the other one has a cork. And that kind of shows their age with the corks you know. instead of the plastic. So. Yeah. They're beautiful. They're, and I like the rounded, the way they're rounded because... Rounded? They're completely round. Well, Look exactly. Up. And that's kind of a more unusual. It's like a golf, that's like a fiesta. It's like a golf ball sitting on a pedestal getting ready, somebody getting ready to tee it off. <laughs> yeah. This is really... What, what did you, you say? Right there. Oh, right there. Yeah. It's really cute. It's um, oh, it's it a treat. Together. Either a cookie jar or a treat jar. Or your little schnauzer. And he's gray with lots of white going on here. I'm holding back here so you yeah. can see the whole thing. Yeah. He's pretty big, but he is so He's probably cute. about 14 inches mm -hmm. tall. Yeah. And it's California pottery. Make a nice little yeah. container for, you know, your doggy treats. Dog treats, cookies, whatever you want to do. If you're a Schnauzer fan, obviously, or just a dog fan. Um, but it is California pottery. Where does it show that? Right yeah, here. the the it's marked right there, and then it's kind of like gold right here on the on the outside. How about this little guy? Mm -hmm. He's cute. He's Just not marked. Regular. But look at those eyelashes. Look at those eyelashes, look. baby. Let me tell he you. He reminds me of Thumper. Yeah. You know Bambi. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. If you can say something nice. Don't, Don't say, say anything it at, all. at all. So anyway, just, yeah, yeah. cute. Cute, no chips, no cracks, perfect shape, pink, cute pink little ears. Perfect for Easter. Perfect Once for again, Easter. some Easter decor. Okay, here we go. Dachshunds, I love dachshunds and I have friends that, they think dachshunds are just absolutely the world and they have some really cute dogs. I looked, it has the white, it, the glaze is very shiny. It has the lovely white here and under his belly and he's brown. Um, his face is really cute. I thought maybe he was Rosenthal and so I was really trying hard to make him Rosenthal, but I don't think he is. So I don't know with that shiny, shiny glaze like that, I could not figure out who made him, but he is so cute. So he's gonna be on our website because I just fell in love with him. There's another cutie pie doggy doggy. And Bow guess wow. who? Show them the bottom, they'll know who it is. They'll know who made okay. it. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, what do you think? Uh-huh, Royal Copley, that's right. It's Copley. <laughs> it's Copley. I liked him 
And I, I always, when I find something, I'll hand it to Tim because he's better at finding chips and stuff. And he looked this over and, and over and over. And he missed it because... Somebody painted it. Somebody painted it. But if you look really close... Really close, right up here. And we're, we're all about showing everything. We yeah, don't want to try to hide anything. Right. And if you look really close, right on the very top of there... top notch. They painted his a little top notch that chipped off. There might have been a slight little chip right here. They did a good job of, yeah. co of covering it because it fooled but, us. Oh, Tim. I didn't see it. Yeah. But anyway, that's. But it, it's got that gorgeous glaze. It's got that gorgeous Royal Copley glaze. He's Copley and he's cute. He's cute. Yes, he is. Go from dogs to cats. Yeah. Siamese. Siamese. Siamese cats. This is man, M A N N, a music box. It is actually a music box mm -hmm. and it works. We wound it up and it does play. But it plays some a nice tune. But yeah. look at those blue eyes. The eyes are just mm -hmm. iridescent. I mean, they just. It's really nice. Perfect Siamese eyes. Mm -hmm. And the little kitten is asleep, I think. Yeah, eyes are closed. Sitting on a couple of pillows. Just a nice With little thing little to put kitten. on the bedside, yeah. wind it up for the kids to go to sleep at night, whatever. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So that's kind of nice. Well, all right, ignore the labels because I thought I got it off and I didn't. Because, you know, it's my anyway, job to I'll clean. Leave it on there. She left it. This is it um, Italy. Oh, I can't remember the name of it. It's like a real long thistle. Italian name. But the flowers are thistle. And that is actually, when you start researching stuff, this was the hardest thing to research, but then when I figured out that it was a thistle, it just came up and it's it's made, of course on the bottom it says it's made in Italy. That helped, but then the flower being a thistle just brought it right up and helped me research it. The shape is kind of like- Pinched. When it's, it was hot, they pinched yeah. it, yeah. It's pinched and so, so it's- It's kind of nice. It's beautiful, it's really pretty. Um, it's kind of blue, spongy. There's the label. Pattern. So get that off later. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's kind of a blue, spongy with the gold around the top, and um, I just. That's awesome. I just really like it. Yeah. Arnell. Arnells. Yeah. This is an Arnell. It's an Arnell squirrel. And we had one of these a few weeks ago and we sold him already. Oh, we... Now we have another one. Yeah. They were exactly the same except the one we had before was gray. This one's brown. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, now, I'm told that people put these on their tree trunks. That's why, why they have four holes on the paws. So they can be hung Is from that the tree. true? I don't know because I live in Arizona and we don't have squirrels in the Phoenix area and we don't have. I'd be afraid tree if I hung it on my tree, somebody would shoot it. <laughs> <laughs> so I don't know, but it's cool and there's not a thing wrong with it. Nothing. No chips, no cracks. He's beautiful. Perfect shape. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. He's perfect. Bum, chicka, bum, bum. Disco. A little lamp. Disco lamp. Disco lamp. Orange. It's an eyeball lamp. Orange. Orange. Yes. I like the dome down here. It was cool. And uh, it works well. And it just... Now listen. I am the last person to like the 70s. Because, well... It wasn't that old for me. It wasn't that long ago, but this spoke to me. This this spoke to us. We were married in the seventies, so this kind of spoke to us and said, "You know, I remember this. I remember this." So here it is, yeah. and it's and it's great, and it will be on our website. There you go. And you know it's old because it'll only handle a forty watt bulb. So <laughs> yeah, and that's it. That's it. Well. And that, once again, that was an incredible find. That uh, well, estate sale, maybe. Uh, nobody nobody had passed away, but they were moving. So, um, and like I said, she, there's no way they, there's no way they could have packed all that up. And we're gonna go back. We're gonna go back. She said she's gonna do it again next weekend. And if we can get good at this camera thing while we're shopping, we'll put that online. So stay tuned to our channel, please subscribe, like us, comment, and and let us know if we're going the right direction or if you have any suggestions, suggestions because we're kind of excited about this. We've been doing it about three years and we just thought, why don't we show what 
we find. And mm -hmm. there you go. Thank you. We'll Thanks see you watching. later. Thanks for watching. Bye. I